Imagine this. It's the early morning of June 30th, 1908, deep in the remote Siberian wilderness. The sky is clear, the forest still, and then, suddenly, an explosion so powerful it lights up the horizon. A blinding fireball streaks across the sky, followed by a shockwave that knocks people off their feet hundreds of miles away. Witnesses described the sky splitting in two and the blast hotter than the sun. The sound was so loud it was heard as far as Europe. When scientists finally reached the site years later, they discovered 80 million trees flattened in a massive butterfly-shaped pattern covering more than 800 square miles. Yet, there was no crater, no impact site, nothing you'd expect from an asteroid or meteorite crash. What could cause an explosion equal to 1,000 Hiroshima bombs and still leave no trace? Some theories suggest it was a giant meteor that disintegrated mid-air. Others believe it was a comet made of ice evaporating before touching Earth. But the mystery deepens. No fragments, no evidence, nothing conclusive. Then come the stranger ideas. Was it a black hole pacing through Earth? A UFO that exploded? Or even an experiment gone wrong from something beyond our understanding? To this day, over a century later, the Tunguska event remains one of the greatest unsolved mysteries of modern history. A single explosion, powerful enough to wipe out a city, and yet happening in one of the most remote corners of the planet. If it had struck just a few hours later, experts say it could have destroyed St. Petersburg, changing human history forever. So the question remains, what really happened in Siberia that morning?